You can't tell me who I can and can't be friends with. Try me. But, Mom, you can't blame the Buchanans for every dicey situation that we've been in. And this family's seen a lot of excitement long before Rachel and Matthew ever came into the picture. What do you mean? What excitement? What's that mean? It means say goodbye to Matthew. You can see him when he gets back to Landview. Yes, I will. I will do that. Oh, what about Rachel and me? What about you? You need to give up on the hate. Or what? You gonna give up on me? What's wrong? Oh, um, one of my counselees had a relapse. Well, there's your sign. Sign for what? That you need to go home and do your job already. And leave you here on your own. Right now, your patients need you more than I do. Besides, knowing mom and dad, they're probably going to parachute in any second. We have to quit lying like this. Oh, you should have told them weeks ago. Well, we had reasons not to. I know. It's made what? Matthew's surgery and Jared's death. We weren't looking for excuses not to tell them. No, of course not. We've just been trying to find a way that's going to hurt Clint the least. And maybe that's the problem. Who's all this preparation for? Is it for Clint? Or is it for us? I don't know. What are you saying? We could time our uh, confession right down to the perfect second. We could plan everything. But I mean, would that help Clint? Or would it help us? Help uh, us feel like we did everything we could and feel less guilty. I would want to know now, you know, period. So I think we've got to tell Clint straight out. Yeah. Before somebody else catches on to our feelings and does it for us. May I help? You. Hello, cousin. Is Master Clint at home? I have a very urgent matter to discuss with him. A family matter. What do you mean, go free? The DA in California has decided there's insufficient evidence to reinstate the charges against Mitch for Jared's murder. No. He said the case has been compromised by mistakes made by the police when they were gathering evidence, so much so that they wouldn't even make it to court. Jess and I were witnesses. I mean, isn't that evidence? Mitch said he acted in self-defense and that you were covering for Jared. So that's it? Jared's murder goes unprosecuted? Natalie, I am so sorry if... No, no, we knew this could happen. I just don't understand. I mean, Mitch is here, and Uncle Bo is in charge, and, and, and Nora. God, this man murdered two people. Pamela Stewart and, and Wayne Landers. And Nora will do her best. There's got to be evidence, Dad. There has to be evidence. There is, but it doesn't point to Mitch. Honey, it points to Jared. That's because Mitch framed him. We believe that, yes. But he covered his tracks. According to your Uncle Bo, no, he did a very... No, Uncle Bo and John, they have, to, they have to work harder. I mean, he takes three lives and, and he just... He gets to go free? Well, it's not over he yet. He took up Nash! They can't prove that Mitch even touched him. He pulled Jared's body out the casket. A misdemeanor at best, honey. So that's it. You're just... You're saying he... You're saying he walks... He, everything? Natalie. What I'm saying is we just have to be prepared if the worst were to happen. I need to be alone. All right. Why don't I drive you home? No, I, uh, I need to stay here and pack up some of Jared's things. All right. But I'm going to come back in a little bit and check on you. Kill me. How very law-abiding. 
Serve and protect. You know, people have killed me before. Trust me. This time it'll stick. You know, maybe you heard about me. You know, maybe you asked around or you read something. You have no idea what's going on in my head. If you did, you'd know I don't screw around when it comes to the people I care about. That's twice now you have used the euphemism care about instead of love. If you do weasel out of these charges and you find yourself, just happen to find yourself within a mile of Marty or Natalie or Hope or anyone else, I'll kill you right there and then. And believe me, this time will be for good.